Oh, that looks... And I also have Gibraltar. Down here is another territory of mine. It looks like uh, I can't go to America, and all the trading ports have just been uh, put around the ring of the map here. I'm trying to be as thorough as I possibly can in uh, describing this these initial stages for the game. And uh, I'll probably put a... Start building a dockyard in Gibraltar so I can get some ships here. I also believe I had a navy. I have a navy, navy led by uh, Admiral Nelson. Admiral Nelson himself. And I also have another one up here. Led by William Cornwallis. And, uh, I suppose I should fuse these two navies. And, um, go see if we can find some French uh, navies to go beat the crap out of. And um, while we're at this, let's look at uh, the campaign map. See, uh, the French have quite a quite the empire now. They've added more towns and territories to the campaign map, which is nice. They've definitely expanded that. French is now, or sorry, France is now. Looks like about um, five territories versus, or five or six actually versus in. Uh, Empire Total War, they were one territory. Uh, I got the large Russian Empire here, which is... Looks like it's very empty and very vast. They've cut off a lot of the top here. Like, uh... Like, we can't go all the way up and see... They, they only have just the major cities in Scandinavia. There's no Turkey. There is Istanbul, however, and uh, the Balkans. And in here we have a confederation of various uh, German states, which is Bavaria, Hanover, um, Saxony, so on and so forth. The Prussians are still working to unite their territories. And we also have some uh, Italian states through the area, including the Kingdom of Sicily. And I'm just about allied to almost all these states. Clearly, the people like the British. So, to end my turn, I suppose I should check out some of my recruitment options that I have here. Uh, where's my... Why can't I suddenly not recruit troops? Hmm. What are you, what are you talking about? Oops, I'm clicking the wrong thing. <sighs> so, we have some militia, footline infantry, six lower artillery, six pounder artillery, some like dragoons. I'll put a couple line infantry here. Oops. Research technology, and let's see the governmental status. I'm not making that much per turn, unfortunately. Only about a thousand dollars per turn. Hmm. Ministers and trade and all kinds of stuff we all know deeply about. I'm just gonna check my uh how many turns do I have? It doesn't tell me how many turns do I have. I've got to take Spain, some islands, some key regions in France, and Denmark and Hanover. So those are my victory objectives. And I think that's about it. I've, I've gone over all the initial who's its and what's its. That would be uh, necessary. Hmm. Thing. Where's my uh? Merchant trade ship. Can't build one. I think, uh, I'll build a trade ship as opposed to, uh, line infantrymen here. There we go. Let's set up, recruit a, a cannon. But, uh, that's it for this turn, so, I guess, and turn. I want to see how long this takes versus the take, uh, oh boy, I got a whole achievement for ending the turn. Looks like the French Navy is going to ignore me.
Dashin's going to run around uh, in circles or depressions. And <laughs> Not really sure what they're doing. Um, am I at war with the Danes? I don't think so. I should probably check though. Hmm, okay, Let's see here. The Confederation of the Rhine. Although anomaly nominally independent states, the German lands are among the eastern banks of the river Rhine are but mere pawns to this so called Republic of France. Their lots bend to the knee of the Grand Empire and kiss his boots like any other lackeys. There is no time for diplomatic bean counting in this great war. You must either stand with us or against us. Or and they have chosen against us. We must, in all aspects, regard these territories as French possessions. Okay. Interesting. Confederation of the Rhineland has decided that it's gonna give us a middle finger and join the French. Which, as we know, is not a good idea. Hmm. Let's take uh, my navy and go on some. Am I at war? I'm at war with the Bavarian Republic. I have a navy coming in here. So let's uh, take my navy and engage them. Hold on, I just gotta see what time it is here. Uh... Okay, I, it's just that I got class in about 10 minutes. And I don't know if that's going to be enough to to do this battle. So, um, I'm going to save and quit for now. And uh, after class, when I come back, I'm going to uh, engage this Bavarian Navy in, uh, in, uh, in combat. And we'll see how that goes. So, I'll see you guys in a little bit. Peace, thus we should do a shame. We're back, um, back after class. And uh, so on and so forth. Yada, yada, yada. Oh, sorry, sorry. Okay, before I start, this guy, this guy, wh wh what's the guy? Oh, Pizza Pie 999 has asked me, do you, do you have Empire Total War? Like, what kind? That has to be the dumbest question anyone has ever asked me in my existence as a Let's Player. And believe me, I get some pretty dumb questions, but that, that takes the cake. Um, I'm, I'm pretty sure that I have uh, Empire Total War. But, um, okay, so here we go. This is the, uh, uh, Bavarian Navy, Bavarian Navy, about to be engaged by the mighty British Navy. So let's go. Will be the get these, get these Today clowns. I, uh, I thought I told you to shut up. I like seriously, dude. So um, against this navy, I've got, of course got Admiral Nelson himself leading the charge with a. Uh, Plenty of epic ships like the a 600, uh, a 106 first rate, um, second rates, and then you got you got third rates, and uh, fifth rate, and these guys just have a bunch of uh, third rate trade ships, and um, are led by Admiral uh, Jean Hendrik von Kingsbergen. Against uh, against the mighty British fleet. However, I think I'm going to crush these guys in a in a mighty blow. Apparently, this battle cannot be played in a, as a drop-in battle. So uh, let's just do this. All right. So just uh, looking at the uh, the navy here. Whoa, whoa. Ho, ho. I'm, uh, as always, I'm not a very good uh, admiral, so don't expect mind-blowing maneuvers out of this battle. Oh, thank God. I don't want to talk to that clown. So, uh... I'm basically just gonna have these guys move up right alongside their, uh... their ships. So let's, uh, see if they've... They, they've made some significant, uh... interface changes, if you can see here. They've made it so, uh... All the units now are a bar at the bottom instead of there being two stacks on each other. They've moved the uh, fo advance, rotate, and uh, buttons to the top. Apparently I can repair ships now. Um, and 
uh, here's my firing of the guns panel. Where's uh, I know I had another another admiral in this battle, but I guess he's uh, he's decided to do uh, that. It's his day off, and he's not going to participate with uh, Admiral Nelson. Of course, the ships look as astounding as ever. Nothing uh, much has changed. I'm going to skip to the engagement part.